uh, we, uh, we're going to be watching it with you live here on YouTube. So you don't have to go find the video somewhere else. Somehow, some way we're able to play this one. So we're going to play this one and you'll watch along with us. But before we get back into the episode, Tony, I wanted to ask, uh, what's going on? What's shaking bacon? Did you take a big victory lap last week? It's big news. AEW came out and announced last week during the five-year anniversary, the big news AEW is here to stay. They've renewed their deal with Warner Brothers Discovery, a new three-year deal. Pretty exciting times for AEW right now, is it not? It's a great time, but it's a great time for pro wrestling to be able to say that another uh, promotion has a big-time clearance. Looks like we're going to be on collision, and uh, or we're going to be on TNT and, and TBS for, I guess, I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know if you've read it or not. I heard four years, and I've heard five. Uh, I'm not sure, but we're also going to be on Max, which will be the home of our pay-per-views now. And uh, I guess it looks like we're going to end up putting our library on Max too, which is it's great news. So yeah, it's it's great news. A lot of hard work went into that. I understand. We've got a lot of great people in the front office. We've got a pretty good front office right now, and uh, it's expanded. We got good people in place, and I'm very happy to be with them. We are too, Tony. It's so great. So great that you're back in wrestling and it's so great that AEW got renewed. I heard that it was a three-year deal with a four-year option, but maybe it is four with a five-year. I mean, hell, you work there. You wouldn't know better than me. No, but I wouldn't know better because, uh, uh, I just don't know. I, we were, I, they kept saying, well, we're, we're close. We're close on a deal. And I would say like, what do you mean close on a deal? We're, we're, we're just close on a deal. Now that's not Tony talking. That's some other people in the front office. <clears throat> because sometimes it's hard to get in touch with Tony when you're not at TV. And when he's, when he's at TV, he just wants to talk about doing TV. Um, so we got, I kept, they kept saying, well, we're close. I said, well, okay, good. Close on what? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all we can tell you. We're close. I said, all right, then fuck it. Uh, I'll just wait and see what happens. But they were always close which made me feel good. I didn't think that we're close on closing or closing the door, so to speak. But so I don't know if it's uh, three years with a four year option or four years, with a five year option. I don't know. I think it's three with a four year option. And I was like you, I'm led to believe, or I'm under the impression rather that's better to say that the archives are going to be on max, which I still call HBO max. Just like a lot of people still call it WWF. Like, mm -hmm. I understand it was how we combined an app for both HBO and Cinemax. And that's why we called it that, but I had it forever. It's still one of my favorite apps and my wife and I still call it HBO max, just like I still call X Twitter. So I'm old. I'm sorry. Right. But, yeah. uh, the idea that, man, there might be a library to go watch old dynamites and old collisions. Like we could, you know, go watch old Rawls or SmackDown right now on the Peacock network. I think that's really cool, man. I'm excited for this. I am too. And for those of you who say, well, let's, we'll turn it on one day and we'll have the entire library up. That's not the case. Right. It takes time. It, it takes, it takes time. There's, uh, I don't know, processing you got to do and, and different things. And so it's, you, you got to have the, uh, you got to have the manpower really to put the, uh, put the uh, library up. And I'm not so sure we have that manpower in place right now. It sounds like something that you might outsource. I mean, I don't have any inside information, sure. but it does feel like you could just give the, the hard drives, if you will, or the download links to someone and they could go in. Cause I would imagine what they have to do, Tony, is they have to scrub out all the old ads, uh, all the old lower thirds and things like that for promotions or what have you, and just yeah. get it ready for, to become an evergreen product, if that right. makes sense. Yeah. So. I, we've talked to some folks at adfreeshows.com who helped put together the WWE network more than 10 years ago. And we spent a lot of time talking about what a labor intensive uh, opportunity that was. So I've got my fingers crossed for it, but I do want to ask you, and again, I get that you don't know, but I do want to ask, do you think that there is a chance that when we're watching the stream, because what I, I I believe the case is you don't have to watch TBS and TNT. Now you'll be able to watch the shows on Max as they're happening. They're streaming live. If you're doing that, is that going to be like the fight feed where there's no commercials and we get to hang on during the breaks? Or will there be commercials on Max? Do you know? Don't know. Yeah, I'm fascinated by that. 
Yeah, I hope there is commercials because we say a lot of silly shit on there. And I hope there's not because you say a lot of silly shit on there, and I yeah. want to be able to be a part of that. Yeah. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, sometimes we get too silly, I think, but we still have a lot of fun doing it. And uh, oh, with that in mind, uh, we uh, we're going to be uh, doing uh, as we are uh, taping this. Uh, we've not yet done dynamite for this week but as it airs dynamite happened last night on what was called title tuesday oh that's right yeah yeah and uh so we got uh we got a lot going on we got a pay-per-view coming up this weekend um uh, we'll see but uh as far as silly shit is concerned sometimes that that silly shit just kind of uh kind of melds over into uh into the regular broadcast and that's when that's when tony calls us on it but he pretty much lets everything go on the uh on the commercial breaks you mentioned it we should definitely plug it this weekend is wrestle dream and what a show it's going to be we've got brian danielson taking on john moxley for the aew world title we've got mariah may taking on the winner from title tuesday which as you're listening to this you know who that is but tony and i do not we're recording on a monday We'll also see the Young Bucks on a pay-per-view against Private Party for the tag team titles. This is a big opportunity for Private Party. I mean, I hate to stretch like this, but this feels like it might be one of the biggest matches of Private Party's life right here. I'm really glad for uh, Quay and and um, and Zay, and I'm I'm really glad because they're two really good kids who've worked hard, and and Mark Quinn has had his share of injuries. I think it's going to be pretty spectacular what these kids can do. And you, you can go back and you can remember the first time they met on TV, our second ever dynamite where they upset the young bucks in the tag team tournament. So I, I'm glad they're, they're getting the shot. Of course, the young bucks always give you a great match. They always do. So this should be great. Hey, Hey, it's Conrad Thompson here to tell you a little more about what adfreeshows.com is all about. Get early ad-free access to more than a dozen of your favorite wrestling podcasts every single week, starting at just nine bucks. That's less than 20 cents an episode each month. And yes, you can listen to them all directly through Apple podcasts or your regular podcast apps. How easy is that? Ad-free shows also has thousands of hours worth of bonus content and docu-series like title chase, Eric fires back conversations with Conrad and the insiders. Plus new series like the book with David Crockett, Monday mailbags with Mike Kyoto and Nick Patrick and a whole lot more. And you want to talk about early. You can't get any earlier than listening to the shows live. You can be a part of the live studio audience as we record the podcast. Plus ride shotgun alongside your favorite childhood heroes for live watch alongs, Q and A's and other interactive experiences every single month. Come on now, see for yourself what thousands of other wrestling fans from around the world have discovered that adfreeshows.com is the best value in wrestling. Check it out today. And Hey, when you do the first week is completely free Adfreeshows.com. 